this is it. This is the future of electricity, this is the future of energy. This is where we face the future and, and, and figure out where we're going. It's like a gift from nature. Silicon, I mean, it's something that you know as sand that has this kind of power of absorbing photons and creating electricity. 1950s technology. Bell Labs. So you want to know how it works? So the sunlight comes in and hits this blue-black stuff. That's the silicon. A photon of that sunlight basically knocks loose an electron from that material. It migrates to these thin lines you can see here all over the panels. And then those thin lines connect up to the big line. It carries the electricity off and into your house. Electricity from sunlight. So when we talk about what costs more and what costs less, you know, you think about coal electricity, that's the cheapest, right? But when we're talking about how cheap it is, we're not talking about the health effects from the coal pollution. We're not talking about the expense of getting rid of the coal ash. We're not talking about the expense of the pollution, frankly. That's all external to the cost of the electricity from burning coal. When we talk about the expense from solar, you're not getting any of the benefits from including those health benefits that are, that are here because this is a non-polluting form of energy. So yes, it costs a lot up front, but then like nuclear, once you've paid that upfront cost, you get all these other benefits. Choices, trade-offs. It depends on what matters more to you. You know, is it cheap electricity to kind of keep our factories humming and we don't worry so much about the pollution? Or is it slightly more expensive electricity that was distributed on everybody's house? We're all making our own and uh, creates this kind of solar industry. And maybe those jobs are here.